Joy to the world. Joy to the world. Yeah. Lord, let, let earth receive her king. Let every heart prepare our Jesus room. Let heaven and nature sing. Let heaven and That's nature the sing. Like, like that let, right there. Heaven, <laughs> let heaven and nature sing. That's one of my favorite. Yeah, me too. Yeah. I'm going to rewrite that one. I, I, I started Joy to the World for Rock and Roll. Uh -huh. Let all earth angels sing. Oh, right? Yeah. Oh, earth yeah. angels. And then, and then it goes the cleft tones and the magnificence. Beautiful. And, the, and the, all that. the rhythm pattern is great, too. It could easily be turned into dignified rock and roll. Well, you know, it's that second chord that they come. Yes. Dun, dun, da, da, dun. That always killed yeah. me when I was a kid in church. That's, see? Oh, yeah. <laughs> There's a lady that actually, a woman, when I'm stripped down to my naked, she helps me lay the towels out for my shower. This is a full grown woman. I said, oh no. But I think at one point, <laughs> she wasn't embarrassed, but I said, don't tell the world what you're looking at. <laughs> yeah. There's a lot of intimacy in, in a hospital. Really, really. You know, right. the, you're so close to somebody that it, it, it's kind of incredible. You're right about that, yeah. I said, oh my God, the Swan Silver Tones, they're on with Lewis Johnson and the lead. Oh, mama mia. I said, this is a wonderful. These boys had been together, most of the groups, since they were something like uh, 10 years old. The parents guided them, and they, they had all the home business. When I hinged up with wanting to know more about the late great mother of gospel song, Mahalia Jackson, she said the Lord's Prayer, <laughs> and I said, oh, wait a minute, folks. I said, I'm, I'm, I'm about to have to put my Budweiser bottle down for a minute here. Listen to that voice and the personality. Yeah. She said, you watch those promoters, honey, because they're bound to take your money. They don't care how much we love God. They just want your cash, baby. I said, I'm going to cry. This woman's real. She's right down to her, her soul. Oh. Fats Waller loved Albert Ammons as a friend. He says, you're my buddy, you're my brother, but I don't keep that darn boogie-woogie away from me. You play boogie-woogie, I'm going to play what I want to play. Well, that's how successful both men were. There was no embarrassment. Ammons kept going until he was like the epitome of what you could do with boogie-woogie without making it monotonous and overdoing it. And here's this uh, Fats Waller, ultra-commercial king. He jumped over all the styles yeah. to get to a style that became... He was, he, he was a pop player. Yeah, Sinatra could have stood it with him. I love Sinatra, and I never thought I'd say that because I was always a Jerry Lee and, and an Elvis man and from the Elvis administration, and I'm not ashamed to admit that. Sinatra was cool with everything he did. Oh, mm, 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 mm. brother can pick up on this and sing his heart out and say thank you to all you guys for coming in here and being in disciples of the best. <laughs> Amen. Happy this, birthday, I, I, Preacher Jack. Thank you. Thank you. We got a signed date today, Mr. Lincoln. We called him the Rabbi of Jazz. And Rabbi, of course, we know means teacher, so you never, never call me Sanford. My mother called me that, and she's the only one that got away with it. I said, okay, Sanford. <laughs> <laughs>